Ladies and gentlemen, time for the next of our showcase matches this afternoon. The match to decide third and fourth place in the men's recurve individual. Coming out first, he qualified in second place here. He is the 2013 Outdoor World Champs team silver medalist, shooting on target number two from the Netherlands. It is Schiff Vandenberg. And his opponent in this match, shooting on target number one. He's the 2007 Indoor World Champion, the 2011 European Archery Festival winner. Please welcome to the field of play from Germany. It is Sebastian Robert. And your line judge for this match is Joe Orbell. So Larry, this is stuff we know a bit more about. Definitely the men's recurve. Yeah. Wow. Starts to get good now, doesn't it? This is the bronze, the bronze match. Um, Sebastian didn't have a great qualifying. He nearly didn't make it while ranking in 28th and he's now made it to the bronze match. No. Yeah, yeah. It's just We're a chef second, so... Yeah. Chef is shooting very well. Yeah, he was second in qualifying and he's now in the bronze. You can see Chef shooting uh, the thin X10 arrows, which is the outdoor normal, the preferred outdoor setup. Whereas you can notice by Sebastian, he's shooting aluminium no. arrows, which are a lot thicker in diameter. Yeah. But that everyone says they get line cutters and stuff like that with them, but I always found when you do softer shots, you get punished a bit more with those fat arrows, don't you? And the Definitely. Thin ones you can get away a lot more. Definitely, they're a lot slower um, arrow. Um, so yeah, when you make a mistake, it's it's big. So that's first blood, first blood to Chef. Yeah, he's got asterisk on that nine, it could go 30 29, but I can't remember how close that was. It's that first one, wasn't it? I, I think that first out. one was in. Tied first set, and in fact, it is that arrow was a nine. It's one point each after the first set between Sebastian Roberg of Germany and Chef Vandenberg of the Netherlands. Another slightly different, another slightly different thing about Sebastian's setup is those twins, which are quite interesting. Yeah, he's he's got the um, a swing bar, it's called. Yeah. Um, where they they do that just that they swing. You ever had a go with some of them? No, I've never tried them. Um, Simon Terry used to shoot them, I think, a long time ago. Yeah. Um, for fun, I think. <laughs> <laughs> that give you guys a chance to catch up, was it? Or yeah, maybe. Fun, yeah. yeah? <laughs> So it was tied. It was out. So it's a tied, tied match so far. So that's a ten. Definitely a ten, isn't Dead it? Dead center. Oh, he didn't like that one. Didn't did he? like he that got, one. But got away he with got, it. Got it. Strong shot. He's looking a lot more confident than he is, and he's um, he's on a run of tens now. His first arrow was out again in the nine, like Ada and Kim. So and they're solid we'll tens as well, aren't they? He's they are. Messing about. Yeah, then they they are solid tens. It's another ten. It's fantastic shooting. It's a five from six tens. Sebastian needs a 10 here to keep in touch. He does, he's, the pressure's on, and he shoots a nice 10 as well. Got it. So it's 2 all. This is what you want from a gold medal match.
five of them tens for each archer. Fantastically consistent shooting. Unbelievably, neither of these two archers have won medals yet in this indoor season, although they are decorated. Chef Vandenberg qualified in second position. Getting a slightly easier draw through the competition to this stage. Sebastian Rohrberg of Germany qualified in 28th position, so he had more work to do. But here they both are, and Vandenberg of the Netherlands will shoot first again in this third set. Both these guys are pretty experienced indoors, aren't they? I think um, Chef's a team gold medalist indoors at the European Champs, maybe. And yep. Sebastian, he's won face to face maybe a couple of times. Definitely. They're both very strong indoor shooters, like you said. Yeah. I think that's. <sighs> wow, that looks close to the line, that top face. Good strong shot. So the door has been slightly opened. Yeah, at this stage you need to take take the chances when you get them. You know, Definitely them take, off and do you? No. Take full advantage. No, that's Not a, like that. That's an eight. That's a mistake. That's what we say before when you know make a mistake with the big arrows. It's big. Yeah, I think if Chef had done that with his skinny arrows, it would have been an, a nine, wouldn't it? I think so, yeah. Got away with it. Yeah. So this is to take the set. And he gets it. <laughs> this a nice little one. hole building in that bottom face, isn't he? Yes. Like when you get one of those faces and you get to it and you just you know it's going to go there, don't you? You can just get on and shoot. Yeah, when, you, yeah, when, you've, uh, when you've been hitting the middle out of the face, you know it's going to go in. Yeah. And both of them actually looking at their faces just then, they both... By the time they get to that bottom face, they know what they're doing, don't they? They just go for it. Definitely. At the European Archery Festival 2014. Remember, you can follow us on Twitter, hashtag EAF2014 and hashtag IWC Telford. This is stage three of the World Archery Indoor World Cup. These archers, as well as their eye on prize money here, are hoping for a place in the grand finals in Las Vegas in two weeks' time. So playing catch-up on target number one, Sebastian Roberg of Germany. Okay. So Sebastian needs to shoot this strong. He needs yep. this set. Needs at least the tie, doesn't need to kind of keep it. Yeah, alive he, need, a little he, bit. he needs the three and the ten. Ooh, I think that might out be out as well. That could be it. Dead, dead center. Good strong shot. But it, this could be, this could be all over for Sebastian. Dramatically, he will take the match six points to two. We will see, and yes, he has done. His arm is aloft. The youngster is a 6 2 victor over the old hand from Germany. Ladies and gentlemen, the third place, Schick Vandenberg of the Netherlands. And bravely shot by Sebastian Robert of Germany. Congratulations to both our archers.